uh, communication team as well. But um, tell me, how, how is it going for you campaigning up to today? And, and, and by close of today is the decided moment, the campaigns. How has it been? Well, it's been good. I have to say thank you to God. I mean, going around Ghana, all 60 regions, all 275 constituencies, it's only God. So I thank him that uh, I, at least I'm alive to see today. And then it's been an interesting journey. I've loved going around. I've loved meeting our people. I've loved meeting the women of my party. And I can say that it's a great learning experience for me. I, I've enjoyed, I've really enjoyed this campaign. I know it's been six years, two years of the current term, now the second term, and when um, you ascend the next uh, uh, stage, it also means that you have four more years, taking two years to end the term and another two years for the next term. Now, uh, you, you'll be hearing a lot on the, on the campaign grounds. What are the positives? What are the take, negative takeouts you think that we all need to have a lot of thinking about? Well, the positives are that um, the people still continue to love the MPP and they express their disappointment because they love us and they expect us to do better. So those are the positives I picked up on our roots, that we need to do our things better. And if we do, our dream of making the impossible, something that has never happened in Ghana, of going beyond eight years can be done. The negatives are that they expect changes. They expect us to change the face of our leadership. They expect new people with new ideas, with new strategies. And that is what I, Ellen, am offering for the Women's Wing. I want us, to, I'm offering the new, uh, the new vision, a brand new energy, brand new everything. But we do need the new people to be able to break the eight that we are all making so much noise about. And if we don't make those decisions today, uh, would have to go back and do a reassessment. So I'm number two on the ballot. Uh, number two? Yes, number two on the ballot. How, how, how many um, delegates are voting for you? About 900 and something. With our own, it's only the women who vote. And I'm um, competing with an incumbent and her deputy. So it's, it's, a, tough, it's a tough race. But I, I, I'm sure I would, I would win. And uh, by God's grace, I'll do what I want to do for the women of the party. Okay. So my last question. Um, what do you think is integral to your campaign message that if you come, you want to achieve for the party's women and the general reorganization of the party or entrenchment? I believe I, I offer a message of hope. I offer the, the opportunity for us to start all over, all over again as a women's wing. I offer the opportunity for a lot more women to be included in our governance and in our party structure. And I know my, my women have listened and they will do the right thing. Yeah, they are playing Buga. Nice song, right? So, and <laughs>